Hello students, today's agenda is to check homework. We'll be graphing coordinates uh, and you will be able to work on page three. Students will be able to graph coordinates also called order pairs to form a picture. And they are also called points. So coordinates, order pairs or points refers to the same thing. So in the next lesson, you're gonna learn more about the coordinate plane, but today, um, we're going to be basically just graphing uh, coordinates to form a, a picture. So before we start, I'm going to share with you that this is Y. And then at the bottom, we will have negative Y. This is negative X and positive X. Okay. And so basically, when we have a coordinate a coordinate or order pair it means that we have the information for X and Y so every single time it's in order alphabetical order so the first one is X the second number is Y okay for every single point that's the same X Y X Y X Y okay so having that in mind let's start with the first one so this is X, it's horizontal, this is Y. And so it says that on X, we're gonna move, we're gonna start here, which is called the origin. And I shouldn't have put a point in there. Um, so that's zero on X, I don't move anywhere, and I don't put the point. And then I travel on Y eight. So I'm gonna go up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's my first point. Okay, notice how when an X, I don't put it, only on Y. The next one, you have X, negative one, Y is seven, so negative one on X, so you go to the left, you don't put the point, and then seven on Y. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You go up because it's positive. Okay, and this one was negative, so you go to the left. If it was positive, you go to the right. What I'm going to ask you to do is to connect this point, which is negative 1, 7, to the previous one. Okay, so I think I can do it without the ruler, which is right here. Um, the next point is 0, so I don't move on x on y, and then negative 5. Negative 5 on y... So basically this is left or right depending on the the sign and this is up or down okay so negative five goes down because it's negative so one two three four five and that's where you place your point <clears throat> because it's a little farther i'm going to use my ruler okay and i connect it to the previous one to the second point Okay, the next point on X, which is left or right, is 1. Since it's positive, you go to the right. Don't put the point in there. And then 7. So 1, one 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Right there. And connect it to the third point or the previous point. Okay, lo vamos a conectar al anterior. Then... Um, it says x is 0, y is 8, so it's 0, you don't put the point, and then 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, right there, and it's just to close the figure right there. <clears throat> so, it's a stop, you're not going to connect this point to this one, so that's why it says stop in there. So now it says start at one seven one on x seven on y right there and then five on x nine on y so one two three four five one two three four five six seven eight nine okay so five to the right nine up both are positive so right is positive up is positive for y 
okay the next oh and we connect it to the previous one okay so one seven was right here you can connect this one right there <clears throat> the next one is eight on x nine on y so eight one two three four five six seven eight nine one two three four five six seven eight nine right there and connect it to the previous one <clears throat> i'm going to start counting i think you get the idea i'm going to start counting a little faster so ten six ten six right there so positive 10 positive 6 that's why to the right and up and then 10 so 10 is all the way over here and then 3 right there 1 2 3 both are positive that's why it goes to the right and then up remember always to the sides first and then up or down the next one is six to the right one up so six to the right one up and connect it to the previous one four to the right because it's positive one up because it's positive so four to the right one up right there and connect it to the previous one uh, then it says 7 negative 3 so 7 is positive it goes to the right 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 negative 3 because it's negative it goes down so 1 2 3 now remember we don't put the point in here when we travel on X only once we finish the tick tick okay tick tick or tick tick or tick tick so until you do the two steps that's when you place the dot and connect it to the previous point right there the next one is six to the right and it's negative so six down so six to the right six down I'm just keeping by two as you can see um, so I'm counting basically faster but it's just one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. The next one is two, negative four. So two to the right, negative four. So you go down because the Y is up or down depending on the sign. And finally, one, negative one. So one to the right negative one down and then it says stop the next one <clears throat> so I think you get the idea I'm gonna do the other side but if you all feel you're ready you can go ahead and do the assignment for today which is page three so in here is negative one seven um, negative one on X means to the left and then seven it goes up because it's positive so it's right here so negative one then one two three four five six seven so this is the first point for this section okay and then the second point which will connect to the first point is negative five nine so negative five one two three four five it's negative so that's why you go to the left and then not nine will be one two three four five six seven eight nine right there okay you connect it to the first point which was right there then the next point is negative eight for x positive nine for y so negative eight one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight nine okay as you can see i'm doing a little faster so that you can actually get to your assignment negative 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 
and then positive six one two three four five six right there it's that one right there connect it to the previous point and negative ten three negative ten three positive three so that's why you go up okay negative six one so negative six I thought count so three six and then one and connect it to the previous point negative four positive one so negative four positive one right there uh, after that is negative seven negative three both are negative so negative seven three six seven and negative three you also go down okay notice how the dot is placed after after you count on x and y negative six negative six so negative six means to the left and negative six means down okay so right there and connect it to the previous one negative two negative four so negative two negative four and finally negative one negative one so negative one is to the left negative one is on the y you go down and connect it to the last one and so that's the picture that we created with these coordinates uh, now you can go ahead and do page three and enjoy <laughs>